of DNA Drives and we're at about 685 subscribers and if you're not already subscribed we'd love to have you so just again thank you so much for taking time out of your day to watch this video and hope you enjoy it here it is hey guys, today is Tuesday and I am about to start with the install process of mounting the spoiler onto my trunk I'm not gonna lie I'm pretty scared to drill some holes through my trunk and spoiler but got man up put the big boy pants on get it over with so first things first let's set up this garage get stuff out of the way move my desk car and let's get started Goodbye, trunk as I know it. Oh, so beautiful. No holes. Hey guys, I just want to pop in here for a second and say I hope you're enjoying the video and if you are give it a like But anyways, what you're seeing here in the video right now is I'm taking 80 grit sandpaper to my beautiful trunk Man, I can't tell you how scared I was to do this, but <laughs> So the reason why I did this was so I had a rough surface for the panel bond to stick to You don't have to do this, but it is a better way to make sure that the panel bond that sits in between the spoiler and the trunk has something to latch onto. It's kind of a peace of mind thing also to do, but I just wanted to say that real quick. All right, so what I'm doing right now is because the spoiler doesn't sit perfectly on this side. Ooh, sorry for the camera, it's wiggling. I'm gonna take this heat gun and try and bend it to the shape of the trunk. I don't know if you're not supposed to heat up fiberglass or not, but let's, uh, let's just give it a little bit of a try and see what happens. It's probably going to melt. I thought I smelled a little smoke, but it turns out my, uh, my neighbor is having a campfire across the street. I'm gonna try some more when I get it on, but. is just cover the whole surface not drench it but try and get every area every little section you can Uh, no going back. Yeah, 
that's where I want it. All right. Holy cow. This is insane. Hey, listen to the sound of this. Hey, show this to Rio. <laughs> Looks like crap. What? Bro, I messed up at first. <laughs> I drilled the hole and it was in the completely wrong spot. <laughs> and I... In the wrong spot? Yes, at first. <laughs> I had this giant gap down here. Yeah, but I, I got it fixed. <sighs> I'm just trying to flex like my uncle, you know what I'm saying, bro? What'd you think, bro? What, your sexy facial hair? I'm jealous, bro. I can't grow any. Can I have it? Dude, you always be looking so slick. I can't even tell, bro. To be honest, you always just be looking so slick and sexy, bro. Hey, I'll forgive you this one time, alright? Fine, bro. Whatever. No, it's the twelve, dude. <laughs> Get it straight. Hang on, bro. Oh, there you go. That's a front row seat right there, baby. That's sick. Hey, can you see this right now? Dude, this project making me so hype, bro. I was so scared at first. I took that first step, though, and then I was off. That first step was take 80 grit sandpaper to my uh, trunk. Dude. Oh my gosh, that's the car. Ah! It's gonna look even better when I make it seamless right here. I think I'm gonna leave it like this. And then have this come out and be seamless, blend into the trunk right here. What do you what do you think about leaving it like this? I kinda like it bro, I ain't gonna lie. What do you think about the spoiler? She's shaking her head, man. So going forward, in the next video, my plan is to quote unquote mold it, make this seamless right here. And you won't be able to see all the bolts that are holding it. And then my plan is to make this seamless right here. So you won't be able to see the transition. And then I think I'm gonna do this part as well. I'm not 100% sure, but I'm, I'm going to do this part for sure. And then I'm also not 100% sure about this, but I think I'm going to leave this gap right here and not make this seamless. Only this. This will blend into this piece right here. Because I was thinking, I'm not sure how it is on this car, but I don't know if you need to pop up this whole thing to change the license plate lights that are underneath there or not, but I think I'm just going to leave it. That is going to do it for this video. Thank you so much for watching this video. Stay tuned for next week where I'll be molding it. And then probably I'll make one more video on painting it and then showing off the final results. So it's pretty cool that this thing is it's coming along. It's coming along. So stay tuned for the next couple of uploads on the spoiler install. Thank you so much for taking time out of your day to watch this video. We'll catch you in the next one. Take care.
It all started when a duck met another duck, and they met another duck, and they became the duck trio. The end.